All around Chicago, you'll find vendors slinging the city's beloved version of the all-American hot dog, an all-beef frankfurter with yellow mustard, relish, chopped white onions, tomato wedges, a dill pickle spear, sport peppers, and celery salt, all perched on a poppy seed bun. But out of all the many hot dog joints in Chicago, one chain has stood out for more than 50 years, Portillo's. I mean pickles, thank God! When you start to get that grease action on the outside, you know it's good, you two. You come to Portillo's, no matter how packed it is, you're getting hot, fresh food every time. Portillo's bread and butter is undoubtedly the Chicago dog. These are the best hot dogs in Chicago, period. The other main attraction at Portillo's is Chicago's iconic sandwich, the Italian beef. Composed of roast beef and spicy jardinera on French bread, this regional favorite is best when it's ordered wet meaning fully submerged in savory beef gravy. The beef, I mean, that's, that's why I come here, but I love I love the beef, it's so delicious. But in a city with countless options for both hot dogs and Italian beef, what keeps people coming back to Portillo's? I've never seen any restaurant like this before. Yeah. You just walk in and you feel like you're in a different age, different era, it's, it's, it's very people. unique. But despite its diehard fans, some say Portillo's sold out. In 2014, the company was sold to a private equity firm in a deal that was reportedly worth close to $1 billion. But the sale was good news for homesick Chicago expats, as the beloved hot dog joint went on to expand with dozens of locations beyond the Midwest, including Arizona, California, and Florida. Whether you love it or feel lukewarm about it, there's definitely a strong sense of nostalgia around Portillo's. It's an institution that the people of Chicago grew up on and can still count on to satisfy a craving for a traditional hot dog or Italian beef.